Hi folks, this is Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Going to have a blog post I want to share with you. This is a new uh, social media manager for Facebook fan pages and Twitter accounts called Converse Social. Converse Social. There will be a link to this uh, website below the video so you can be sure to check it out. Um, this is a site that basically you can put in your Facebook fan page and your Twitter account and you can yourself or a team of people that are monitoring your social media can take and uh, watch for different things that might come up on your stream, reply, interact with your uh, people, engage, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. It's also great for flagging items for if you get different swear words or profanity. If you heard recently, there was uh, there was a Facebook fan page that was getting filled with a lot of racial stuff. It was the Lowe's fan page, and whoever was supposed to be managing it wasn't managing and watching it. It filled with just incredible amounts of, of I guess, profanity and, and uh, race, racial stuff. And it eventually made the news, which was quite embarrassing to Lowe's. So it's important that someone's managing your stuff. And what's really great about Converse Social is you can use this to uh, watch for stuff like profanity, uh, things that might be offensive to your thing, and you can very quickly delete them. Uh, from what Converse Social says, uh, they pretty much pulled the Facebook comments in real time or within very close to real time. So you can see here I'm pulling in my mentions from my Twitter feed and I can choose to do several different things. I can add notes to uh, my Twitter uh, thing. Maybe I want to add a note to my team. Hey, let's talk to this guy some more about promoting our thing or whatever the case may be. I can also archive it so that I don't have to look anymore. I can reply to them from here. I can retweet from here. So I can do all the different things that are out there. I can search through the mentions if I so choose to maybe look for certain things that I'm concerned about or that I want to reply to. My direct messages, of course, are being pulled in here also. So, uh, you know, I can deal with that once again. Um, auto flagged. This is stuff, and I'll show you in a bit how this uh, works, but we don't have anything flagged. Unfortunately, the people don't put much profanity through my streams that uh, follow me. Um, things that you're assigned to, you can use this to do groups. Maybe you want to assign, you know, if you have a team or something that's working on the PR, you can take and do that also. Archived uh, issues that might be archived are also in here, et cetera, et cetera. So uh, you can also do a search mechanism where you can go through and search stuff. Um, there's also an outbox where you can have drafts, you can have scheduled tweets or messages that you want to send on a Facebook fan page that you can do also. You can also add multiple users to this. There's, um, there's basically a, a, a trial version they give you where you can have a free account for just one person and then if you want to add more you can do that. We'll get then into more of that here in a second and we'll talk about that. Um, so in essence it gives you a pretty good dashboard to which to work with. This is the uh, Chris Voss Show fan page and what it will do is pull in recent comments and different stuff from the fan page. I've just barely installed this software so that it's not pulling anything uh, as of yet. Um, so normally it would suck in this data and you'd be able to manage uh, the content and uh, et cetera, et cetera. So Converse Social, I think it's a really great app. You can look here, if we go into the account setup, you can go in here and create actual things that you want to target. Uh, they have a default profanities list that's included in there uh, and you can go and edit those. You can decide if you want uh, to have it automatically delete comments on your Facebook fan page that have profanities. On Twitter, of course, if someone's uh, being profane, you can't control their stuff. You can't block them. But it'll, uh, you can adjust auto-flagging things. You can put in different set of things that you want to watch for. Uh, sentiment tracking, which, uh, you know, is negative and positive discussions about your brand. You can manage users, of course, that are in here. We just have a free trial for personal version. And uh, you can manage feeds for conversational feeds in here. Uh, view keyword list that you want to make. If you can see here, they have default profanities, and you can see some of the different one that they, ones that they have there. Um, so it, what this does, it helps you watch out for your brand, for people being really profane or ugly on your brand, using certain words and being able to delete those very quickly or instructing conversation social to do the same. So be sure to check it out. Um, the pricing on it, uh, there's a starter account that you get for free.
And then from a team thing, it's 149 per user per month for a team, enterprise uh, 299 per month. And I'm sure they can do something more customizable if you if you do that too. So uh, it's a pretty good program. I like it so far. I love the idea of being able to flag and target different things. Um, so be sure to check it out. There'll be a link below this video. And be sure to check back to the ChrisVossShow.com several times a day. Bye bye.